Hello everyone, it's me Ellie from Access Press Themes. Today in this video tutorial of Access Press Pro, I'm going to show you how you can do the header setting on your website using our theme. So for, the, for that, just log into your WordPress dashboard. Here in the left side, go to Appearance and just click on Theme option. Then go to Header setting. The first option that you will get is select the header style right now it's the first layout that we have chose so let's go to the back front end of the website and see how it's looking on your website so this is the website we're working on and this is the header layout that's looking right now so you can change this to do this go to the back end of your website and just select any one from the four that I'm selecting the second layout to save our option and go to the front end of the website to see the change so this is the second layout that we chose for the header setting so in this way you can uh, change your header layout so the other thing that you can do with your header is that you can enable a sticky header a sticky header is basically a header that sticks to your website's top. That is, when you scroll it down, there is nothing arises on the top of your website that you cannot go to any page when you are at the middle of the home page. So you can have a sticky header for that. So to do that, just check to enable. You can also show search in the header. So to do that, just check to enable this too and save your option. Now let's go to the front end and let's see how it goes. So now that you have enabled the search button, you will see a search key here from where you can search anything from your website. And about the sticky header, when you scroll your website down, there will arise a header that's just stick to the top so that you can go to any page at any time. So this is how you can check your sticky header and a search button on the header. So the next thing that you can do in the header setting is that you can upload a logo. Right now it's, there is nothing on the header but you can have a logo here. So upload a logo from this and choose a file from your computer. I'm choosing this one and upload it now you can crop and publish and after uploading the logo save your changes and go to the front end of the website to see your logo on the header so this is the logo that we uploaded and is showing on the header so the other things that you can do with this logo is that you can do the logo padding that is you can add some space on the top bottom left or right side of the logo like currently the logo is seeing like this but you can have some space so just to show you I'm gonna add some space on the top let's add 20 and save your option so as you can see you will have a little space at the top so with this you can change the placing of the logo with some points in here so you can also add a header text right now I'm adding an email address so you can add your email address here or your phone number <clears throat> or your cell phone number or anything and uh, along with it you can add a Google map iframe so that you will have a Google map on your header so to do that just go to maps.google.com From here you can get a Google iframe. 
so let's let it okay now simply add an address I'm writing my company's name that is access keys private limited now that you've gotten Google map just click on setting and click on share or embedded map go to embedded map and simply copy this and paste it here and save the option now let's go to the front end of the website here you can see there is a button and when you click on it you will have a Google map on your header so in this way these are the settings that you can do with Access Press Pro regarding the header setting and change some of the setting on the header thank you very much for watching this video I hope this video is very helpful to you and if you have any confusion or comments you can comment us and I'll be more than happy to reply to you as soon as possible thank you very much